Hello everyone. Today I am going to show you how sub templates works in Oracle Fusion BIP reporting. Generally, when the sub template concept comes into picture, when for example there are ten, I'll I'll go with the smaller number. Let's say let's say there are two different templates, and we have for example two BUs, two business units. Now, through the same report, and for let's say BU name one. the customer want to wants to see a particular specific template and for bu name 2 the uh, the customer wants to see a different sort of template let me show you the example for example there is a customer name a uh, there is a bu name abc okay now the, the particular this particular customer there is a customer and there is a bu name abc and the customer wants to see this particular template through the report output when the business unit has uh, chosen is abc and if the business unit uh, is xyz then this particular template needs to come up as an output okay so the first thing is it's like uh, as in my previous video i have explained how to create a bip report so first there should be an sql query then you need to generate an xml through xml text you will have to generate the rtf and then register the report and run it and choose the default or uh, whatever is the output format you would like to see in for example like excel or pdf for example in our case the customer wants to see the output in pdf format this is one format for xyz business unit and this is another format for abc business unit now it's a very simple and straightforward thing you create two two templates independent of anything now there will be a third template where you will call it and you will create the uh, you will execute the sub template concept first thing is you have to import this particular template the template uh, structure and syntax is import xdo xsl then slash 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 and then the path of the sub template where you will put it the name of the sub template i will i'll be showing you how you are going to create some sub templates then dot xsv similarly the other sub template will call it and simple use of if and else if at the red <coughs> excuse me if at the red section bu name is abc you will call a template first the first template which is corresponding to abc business unit and if the business unit is xyz you are going to create you are going to call the X Y Z the the template which is corresponding to the X Y Z business unit. Now I'm going to show you how do we create the sub templates. Log into Fusion application, go to Tools and then Reports and Analytics. Then there is an option called Create. In that, when we create the data model, we go to the data model. When we create the report, we go to the report. Here we are going to create the sub templates. Simple. You click on sub templates. in order to the save in order to save some time i have already created these templates i am going to simply upload it and then show you how you can you utilize them it's a simple and in the same fashion how we you upload a normal rtf template in the same fashion we need to create it at the difference is the extension of these files will be xsv dot xsv click on template file choose your sub template for example this is one sub template corresponding to abc business unit choose the local as english click on okay and then save it as you can see in my folder i have already saved this abc similar to this you will be uploading the other template xyz and eventually once these two sub templates are already there in place you are going to create this particular third file rtf file which i have already shown you and then call, call them into the template as discussed whatever the method we have discussed and you can see is in the same fashion we need to call and import those sub templates and then according to your if and else condition you can read them now 
once those two sub templates have been uploaded you are going to create the another uh, third template same in the same fashion like create instead of sub template you'll go to the report cancel it there is this uh, upload option there is this upload option click on it give some name for example output or the report then choose the template of your interest in this case this will be the template and then the type of template is rtf we have different types of templates which we can utilize at excel flash xsl edx but we are working on rtf template then local has to be again english always and then upload it and then you can simply save it so now in order to save some time i have already done this so here we are so if you can see the you can see the symbol of the files these are two sub templates which we have uploaded and then this will be your report you need to click on edit and then attach the data model of interest and that's it here we go we can you now you will be able to easily execute the concept of sub templates in oracle fusion vip reporting that's all for today my name is ankush tiwari do subscribe my channel for such videos i'll see you again thank you very much